Ryder Wright, what the deal is, it's still lost coming true, and I'm here at the Jackie Robinson Youth Center, the Hall of Rhyme State that is, I'm with the youth, and the truth is now in session. The youth can grow They learn to survive until they gain control Nobody says you have to be gangsters Read more, learn more, change the globe I know I can, I know I can Be what I wanna be, be what I wanna be If I work hard at it, if I work hard at it Then I'm gonna be where I wanna be, I be where I wanna be Big Be what I wanna be, be what I wanna be If I work hard at it, if I work hard at it all the time with true school. That's right, truth from the youth. So we here at the Harlem YMCA, and I want to give a little um, example of the staff here, the activities, and so forth and so forth. Hi, I'm Charles Taylor, director of the Youth and Family Services at the Harlem YMCA, Jackie Robinson Youth Center. And uh, summer day camp this year is a very exciting, exciting camp. Uh, we have a wonderful, diverse camp this summer. Uh, we have an experiment going on here, and I think it's a successful one. What we have is young people making choices about the kind of activities that they'll participate in in the summertime. What we have is excitement, fun, learning, uh, comradeship, friendship, uh, not gaining knowledge about one's community. We have a fantastic, uh, well-rounded experience for every single camper that comes to the home on C.A. Jackie Robinson Center. Because the children are going to show us the way to a better tomorrow. We don't start working with them now. And that's what it's about. Security, security, safety. Well, I just need to give them that just to show them how we are to Thank you. Thank you, Anderson. You're welcome. All right, all right, all right. We here. Sid Locks, yes. True School, yes. doing it up here at the Harlem YMCA. I'm here with Dominic. That's right, for the slow months. Dominic. Right? And he's doing it up. He's one of the heavy hitters here, along with myself, Vivian Anderson, Charles Taylor, when we are the staff here at Harlem YMCA, uptown. Okay, so we want to let you know why Harlem YMCA is so special. Beside that, it's called the Jackie Robinson Youth Center. So, Dominic, let them know something. We're here to teach the kids the four of all core values, honesty, caring, respect, responsibilities. They missing those right now in the neighborhood, so we're here to install those back with the true school sit locks, you know, thank you for that. Um, we're gonna speak about the summer camp. We got different camps for different kids. We got media, we got sports, we got fashion, we got arts, we got dance. These these camps are broken down for kids to bring out the strongest points in each kid so they won't feel left out just in one second. If you're not good in sports, you can go to dance. If you're not good in dance, you can go to fashion. If you're not good in fashion, you can go to cyber. So there's always somewhere here for you at the YMCA Jackie Robinson. You just gotta choose what you like to do and we'll find out and help you do it. Alright, alright, what the deal is? Sit coming true and I'm here, true school, all of my MCA, doing it up, and we are at the staff meeting right now. We're having a little staff session. I've got to be by together. All the members who are putting the children on their path, they, some are from Harlem, some are from abroad, but however, they're here giving back to the youth. So we're going to start with Arthur, and Arthur then is going to, you know, uh, introduce everyone else. All right, so on that note, take it away. How you doing? Um, I'm the group leader for the Half Day Camp. Those are the campers that come in here from summer school. And we're basically here to tutor them and help them get on track so next year they'll be right where the rest of the children are and they won't be behind. Um, this is Jessica, she came up to the YMCA. She's a counselor helping giving back. This is Jessica from the Bronx, Rashida from the Bronx. We have Kayla from down the street. And we have Ebony, another group leader from the Polo Ground. And we're basically here to just give back and help the children in any way possible. Hey! So, oh, how's lovely. everything? How's oh, everything clean? Eh? Everything oh, clean, you doing yes. your job. I feel yes. that. This, this is a gentleman here who I've just met, but is a very pleasant person. Always good morning. Or Gwyneth no, Gwyneth Diaz, right? Yeah, Teaching buenos, me Spanish on the low here. Buenos dias, buenas noches, good night. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everything. 
Mucho, mucho. Mucho, mucho papá. <laughs> What we do at the front desk sir, is that we take payments, we give the parents the information that they need. This is our new system. Isn't it beautiful? It pretty about time because they had one from like 1989, 1988. Um, pretty much the receptionist area. That's what it is. Hey, how, how you doing, sir? How's everything? Can you give me a little description of what you do here at the Harlem YMCA? Well, I am uh, securing the uh, facility. That's what it was. And um, very accurately. Yes. Results. And, and how challenging is your job? Well, it is challenging, but it's, it's, uh, it's very uh, promoting. to see everyone get along so uh, peacefully and very successfully. And it is, it's a pleasure to be here to serve the community. So we got Miss Abernathy, and she's gonna let you know a little bit about Harlem YMCA, why it's so important, and blase blase. I love the Harlem YMCA. I've been here for several years, and I love the kids, and I love our staff, and thank you for the opportunity. So who else we got here? We got Mr. Mustafa doing it, doing it up. Yes. So um, introduce yourself for those who don't know who you are. Yeah, I'm Mustafa Muhammad. Um, I'm the drama coordinator, aka the group leader, team leader, whatever you want to, whatever you want to um, call me. Um, I work in an after school program with kids like Demetrius Joker. You know, here's my pickup. So me and him got a little special bond. But summertime, basically just getting these kids. I have them doing acting. Screenwriting and directing, so they're doing all specs, and they're not just going to be, you know, one one way, one talented. You know what I mean? They're going to be multi talented. 